everybody. I wanted to come on today and share some new product that I have in my space. Um, I, I haven't seen an up close uh, flip through of the Simple Vintage Cottage Fields yet from Simple Stories. So I thought, ah, uh, I'll just pop on today and share that with you. I've got a few other products as well to show you up close so that you can have a look and see what's what with everything. Um, I know this year I'm really missing the creativation um, little videos from people that went to um, like the scrap time videos and stuff like that where people went and they'd show you the booths and all that kind of stuff. So I just thought oh, I'll pop on here today and show you guys what I picked up. Um, this bunch of goodies here today I picked up from my local scrapbooking store which is called Scrappin' with Tea and they do also have an online store and I will link to that down below. Um, you could also of course pick this stuff up at scrapbook.com or wherever you like to shop. I will leave some affiliate links for these products in the in the description box below so that if you do click on those links I will get a very small commission but I do appreciate that if you do use those links to shop it does provide me with a little bit of a kickback which is very much appreciated. Um, so I am going to show you what I purchased. I love this Simple Stories collection. It's so beautiful. And we'll start off here with the um, self-adhesive brads and chipboard pieces. So with this one, you actually get one, two, three, four, five pieces of chipboard. And so it's a combination of these five chipboard pieces with these self-adhesive brads. So the nice thing about these brads is they're sticky backed. They don't have the, um, you know, the, the little pokey thing in the back. So they're just a little sticky dot basically with the metal rim on them. So they're just gorgeous. I love them. So you can see them up close. They've got, there's that whole color palette from the Simple Vintage Cottage Fields collection. You can see some phrases, some different images. So pretty, love it. Lots of butterflies and birds in this collection. Really gorgeous. And some little chipboard bits. Um, I picked up something that I have never bought before, something that I've been eyeing up, but I haven't purchased one yet. And it's the new six by eight snap flip books from Simple Stories. And this is the one that goes along with these Simple Vintage Cottage Fields. I will slide this off so that you can see what the cover looks like. It is a chipboard cover. It's really nice and lightweight um, and really, really super thin. So very easy to store this little flip book because it's not going to take up much space. Sometimes I like to decorate these little belly bands, so I'm not going to rip this off. It's going to slide it off. And you can just see how there's a real vintage look as with all of the other simple vintage collections. Really pretty. I love it. And then on the inside, there's this really, really soft pink plaid. So it's beautiful. And then you do get um, 10 pocket pages. You get three six by eight, three four by six, two three by four, and two three by four slash four by six. So the two up, one down. And yeah, it's just really nice. It's kind of got like a duotang binding in it. So super easy to take apart. And then you've got all your page protectors there. So really nice. I'm quite happy with that. And this was really inexpensive. So if you're looking for a lower price point for a little mini album that you can put together as a gift or for yourself, uh, these snap flip books are really great. This is something that coordinates with this and it's called the page pieces. So little page pieces that you can decorate your um, layouts with. And so you could do use it with your flip book for maybe like an eight by six page or you could actually use it for a scrapbook album, but you can see how it just looks. These are really neat little packs because in one pack you've got embellishments for a double page spread. Let's say you've got all the embellishments that you would need for that double page spread or, you know, singles if you're doing singles. Um, I picked up the die cuts and also the layered stickers. So this is, there's 12 adhesive backed layered stickers in this pack. And I love the layered stickers <clears throat> from Simple Stories. And they are so dimensional. Like look at all of that foam that's stuck in between the different layers. So you get all of that really nice dimension on those stickers. And they're just beautiful. Like this one has that real vintage look with a little butterfly. 
so cute. Lots of butterflies, lots of little sentiments. This might be my favorite. Look at this one. So pretty, gorgeous. Love that. And I know that scrapbook.com just got all of the ephemera and everything for this collection in stock because <clears throat> they notified me of that just because I'm a, an affiliate with them too. So um, I did get a notification that this collection I think is fully stocked unless it's then sold out. I know it's really, really popular, but just beautiful. So this is uh, the Floral Bits pack. And it has 39 pieces in it. And you can just see here all of the different bits that come with this. And they're just beautiful. So there's a combination of birds, butterflies, and florals in here. And you can see the, um, the size really varies in the die cut pieces. So there's some pretty large pieces, but there's also smaller pieces as well. And that's one of the things I really appreciate about these packs is that there's a variety of sizes. So they're <clears throat> small, medium, and large, basically. Tons of butterflies, lots of florals. But look at, here's a nice little tiny one and another little small one. And the color palette is just amazing. So that is the um, floral bits. And then this is the bits and pieces. So you can see here bits and pieces is 50 pieces in this one. And with this one, you get some phrases, lots of different shapes, some little banners, some journaling spots or layering spots. I love that one. That one's gorgeous. Let's just open it up quick. <clears throat> Take a quick look. I always mix these together in a little Ziploc bag anyway, so I'm not too worried if they get mixed up with the floral bits because it's all going to be stored together, but these pieces are beautiful. And I'm working with the Simple Vintage Heritage Collection right now, and I just love it. It's just so beautiful. It's a little bit of wood grain in there. This, I love that. So that's like that layered sticker, right? So they kind of got some beachy wood grain look going on here. It kind of has a little bit of a beachy feel to it. But lots of little phrase stickers. Hello Beautiful, One Fine Day. Some little tickets again. These are fun. And <clears throat> a little frame. Got some hearts. Hello. A bunch of these banners with different sentiments in them. So many pretty colors. If you're doing some photos of your garden this summer, it'd be perfect for that. I love that piece right there. Gorgeous. So that is the bits and pieces and there's 50 in that pack. Then it's always nice to have the sticker book, right? Um, <clears throat> do, 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 do. Just gonna cut this open. So there are 12 sheets, 648 stickers in total. So you get a combination of florals and hearts, butterflies and birds. Are there birds on there? No birds. Um, phrases circles super cute circles awesome this I always find too like for decorating your little snapbook this would be awesome you got some alphas in a fuchsia three different sizes of alphas small tiles medium size in teal and then large in the fuchsia then the little banners Labels, circles and rectangles, phrases in black with white text. You get a whole sheet of those. You get another sheet, more butterflies and flowers and hearts. <clears throat> Tons of labels, all with different phrases on them. Like right now, in the moment, all my heart, dream big, always and forever, love you more, life is good, best day ever, and more here in the fuchsia the aqua and the black. 
and and more different like they're not these are not all the same phrases over and over again they're very different you get tabs and then more of these little kind of almost like a little it looks like washi tape it's faux washi tape with a phrase on it and that's actually that's something that I didn't get was washi because I didn't see it there she didn't I don't think she had it. She didn't have the chipboard frames, the washi, or the chipboard, so I don't have that to show you, but I know it's available. You can get it. I also got the eight by six paper pad, which I love. And it just has, you know, it's got a smaller um, scale of the same patterns that are in the pattern paper, but it just shows you how, what, how pretty the, the color palette is and all of the different patterns that are in the 12 by 12 paper pad or um, paper collection. So awesome. So you get four by three cut aparts in here. Lots of double sided papers, which is really great for your mini albums because then, you know, if you've got an eight by six um, insert, you know, and it's double sided both sides get finished in one fell swoop, right? Which I love. So it's really nice that those are double sided. So you get 24 papers, two of each design. I also got these, which I, I love these in Simple Stories, the foam phrase stickers, and then the hearts. Got some butterflies and florals and other little bits there as well. Really gorgeous joy so beautiful grateful heart together amazing happiness and wonderful and some smaller ones too here again butterflies hearts some floral pieces so beautiful love that then I've got the collection kit and in the collection kit you get the sticker sheet and you get all of these papers so I'm going to do a quick flip through of the papers there's embrace each day natural beauty and the dot has um, distressing in it which is fun this is sweet life gorgeous there's the back so pretty uh, I dream more that's gorgeous right just love that look and the back is equally as gorgeous um, simple things, beautiful, and that gorgeous dot. So it's kind of got like a pink distressed background and then a small black dot on top. Beautiful moments, just unreal. Like these papers are a work of art. I love this. This might be my favorite. Little birds and butterflies and then all those beautiful florals in the color palette. This one is called Hello Happy. Just exquisite. Really cool back. This is Live for Today. I would say this is probably Vicki Booten's favorite paper from this collection, don't you think? <laughs> With all these butterflies. <clears throat> I'd have to ask her for sure, but I know that she likes this collection. Um, two by two elements. Beautiful. So many things you can do with the two by two cut apart. And on the back, beautiful. So pretty. The four by three cut apart. Super pretty. I love these ones too for journaling and the tone on tone with the floral. And the four by four. Mm, love that one. That's so gorgeous. And more butterflies on the back of that one. The six by four elements. And look at that. Oh my gosh, I should have gotten two pieces of this. Oh, wish list, right? And then the 12 by 12 sticker sheet. So I got the basic collection pack, but you know, you can get the, the bigger collection pack and it'll have some of the ephemera, the die cut pieces and whatnot in it too. So I also got the um, cardstock pack. Super pretty. 
I love that tone of pink and then it's got the yellow on the back. So you got two sheets of each one for a total of six. A gorgeous aqua. That really pretty pale pink. It kind of looks like tattered rose in the distress line. It's gorgeous. And then a black and a beautiful pink. That's more like uh, spun sugar. If we're thinking distress, gorgeous. Now these, I got some extra sheets of the open stock. So these are just the same. So I'll just flip through because we've already seen that. Now, um, so that is the Simple Vintage Cottage Fields collection. That is all that I got of that. There are more pieces. I will link up to the entire collection in the description box below. So if you do want to find that, you can do that. This is the Elizabeth Crafts Worn Wood patterned cardstock. And I think there are 13 designs, 13 designs in here. So this is just really fun. I think it's interesting how they put they put a paper on the back of the packaging. So that's a good use of the paper, right? But I just thought this would be really good for working in a planner or something like that. If you want to cut these apart and use bits, they're just really interesting. And they're distressed, right? So this one has some text on it. Actually, I think most of them have text on them. This one's got like a scripty text. Very cool. Isn't it neat? I love papers like this. Look at this one with the leaf print and a little bit of bokeh on it there too. Very interesting. It's kind of like a water stain on this one. Some text again. A little bit of a, a scribbler coil binding look on there. I love the tones of like blues and greens and yellows that are mixed in with the browns. Super fun. This one's beautiful too. It kind of has that beech wood look. And again, the leaf. And then we start over again. So that is the Elizabeth Crafts Worn Wood Pattern Cardstock Paper. Very cool. I could not resist this collection. I've been seeing people make with it. This is the Doodlebug Made With Love collection and it is just so stinking cute. I absolutely could not resist it. And I had previously picked up the six by six paper pad. So, so cute. Um, and then I got the bigger papers, which has repeat um, prints in it from that six by six paper pad. It includes the 12 by 12 sticker sheet and then these papers here. So cut aparts. Oh my gosh, it's like a baking theme, cooking theme, right? But I just love the color palette so much. Just so sweet. So if you're doing a recipe book, something like that, or cooking themed layouts or projects of all those tags, more tags on the other side, this really pretty floral and then the cut apart strips really bright yellow with a white dot this is my favorite I think this plaid so gorgeous got some little um, chocolate chips super cute and some cookies the mixer and a really pretty color palette again a tone on tone kind of a fuchsia with a heart. Not floral, a tiny floral with the hearts. And this is just gorgeous, this vibrant stripe. So sweet. The yellow background with all of the cooking um, utensils, the apron and whatnot, and the spoons and forks with the gray. Super cute. That'd be a really good neutral for a background. Love these hearts. Isn't this adorable? Cute. And a tone on tone pink that says love you. And then the polka dots, the larger polka dots. So cute. And then a cut apart sheet for creating some, uh, you know, journaling or recipes or whatever. So really, really cute. So really sweet. That's the Doodlebug Made With Love collection. I also picked up the Echo Park Welcome Spring. Uh, collection pack. So this comes with papers 
and a sticker sheet. So in here you get 12, 12 by 12 double-sided papers. I think there's six different um, designs maybe. Let's see here, one, two, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Maybe there's two, I don't, I don't know, we'll see. <laughs> I haven't really looked at it that carefully other than this and I really liked the pattern. So the four by three cut apart sheet. So you get two of those. And that's the back side. Super pretty. I just love these colors. They're so bright and pretty. Soft. Springy, right? Love these. This rain boots paper. And the back of that is that really gorgeous pink plaid. So isn't that pretty? And that one's called rain boots. Then there's the um, six by four cut apart that has the butterflies on the back. Also really adorable. And it's a true white background. Super cute. This paper is also really sweet. Love all of these different icons. And then it's got that really bold, uh, kind of an orangey red with a white dot on the back. Super pretty. Wouldn't that be together? cute together? Love it. The four by four cut apart sheet, which has rain, uh, the umbrellas on the back. Really, really pretty. Super cute. That one's called, oh, that's just the four by four journaling card sheet. Super cute. All the coordinating colors on those umbrellas. And then we've got the bee paper. This one is called um, bumblebee breeze. So it's got the yellow plaid on the back and then the bumblebees on that really pretty soft blue. Gorgeous. Really, really pretty. So that is the Echo Park Welcome Spring Collection, which I think is totally adorable. And I feel like I am probably going to have to search out more pieces to this collection because it is really gorgeous. So that's it. I just wanted to pop on and share that haul with you today. And um, maybe you saw something that you would like to pick up. And it's maybe it's just nice to see some of these things a little bit more up close so that you have an idea of what things are like. Thanks so much, guys, for listening and sticking with me here through to the end. Have an amazing day. Stay safe. Stay well. Leave me a comment if you think of it. Don't forget to hit that thumbs up. And I'd love to have you as a subscriber here on YouTube. See you soon. Bye-bye.